hi and a good morning i like to welcome you to palm praise too i uh, certainly do thank you for tuning in and i hope that peace and blessings have been is and will be upon you this day now I have a just a little comment for you just real quick because when you have good thoughts they're slippery so you need to write them down so due to the fact I've had something that has crossed my mind I'm just gonna put it out there real quick cuz I'm kind of like keeping it moving I got things to do to attend to but so I don't forget I'm gonna drop this real quick for you and I had this come to me when I was just listening to a, a show. You know, sometimes you might listen to something, you be wanting to comment, or you be wanting to have your feedback. So this is my my uh, feedback regarding uh, programs. That's why I'm going to name this, Programs for the Youth. Now, you know how we might have programs, let's say an individual, because I'm going to try to give you a visual, because I'm visual. Okay, we have programs for individuals when they go to jail, right? They... They go to jail, they're in trouble, and then to actually have them re-enter into civilizations. Uh, some of the felons, we might set them up with uh, trying to obtain a job in regards to different programs to try to get them on the right track regarding uh, entering back into civilization. Now, due to the fact I said programs for the youth, that particular concept for individuals who got in trouble we need that same particular concept for the youth who are not in trouble so they go to college right they, they have this degree they get out of college and they actually uh, need jobs okay need jobs gotcha this is where the elders are the people who are already in that profession can set up an internship let's say for example you have a lawyer who has a lawyer firm right they're in their prime maybe they're in their 40s or their 50s therefore you go to the colleges and uh, you search out who's in that same profession maybe you might have applications in regards to the internship who can actually come in so kind of like a, a temporary program where you come in and you get hands-on experience in regards to what you're going to school for in regards to having some steps in regards to where you're going to go so we're going to have a, a leader it's going to get a apprentice <laughs> flow with me on this one an apprentice and then you're actually going to start passing the mantle down no need to go in regards to who can I give it to. It's just in reference to the vision for the future. Take it in different concepts. You know, you could take that dealing with lawyers, dealing with teachers, dealing with doctors, dealing with... We could even take it to the creativity level if you want to. We have some elders that know how to braid. You could be teaching the young how to braid. Just, just get eight. Hey, we could pass that attribute down in regards to sewing. All right, we have all these creativities, but then we just need a business aspect. Okay, business aspect. So we could just form this as a group. So there should be a program for the youth, reference to that. Not, okay, you're, you're off and you have no place to go. No, I'm gonna take you up under my wing. All right, I, I, I see that your uh, flower that is blossoming let me go ahead and nurture this flower so that I can help in the blossoming process and the blossoming formation a vision for the future because doesn't say <clears throat> a man without a vision they perish people without a vision they perish a culture without a vision they perish that may not be in a book, but I just said that in three different aspects. Person, people, culture. Mm -hmm. Here on Poem Praise too. So just in re reference to thinking. What we gonna do? Hmm. We have it. 
what we got to do. Energy to pursue for a nation. Oh, it's real. It's real. For real. So, that's my little quick bit point. I am definitely going to keep it moving. Um, I'm up. Uh, early bird get the worm. <laughs> uh, handling business, you know. No need to sleep. Even though sleep is required for restoration, rejuvenation, and rehabilitation to the body. Yeah, but you don't need to be walking around sleep. Definitely, if you're awake, you should be doing something. I don't know if it's thinking, writing, planning. Planning. Plan for the purpose, for the vision. You know? So that's just the programs for the youth. I'm going to go ahead and end this quick vid on that note. And I want you to have a blessed day. I will uh, talk with you later on today so we can get back into uh, the Black Woman's Guide to Understanding the Black Man. So if you like this video, like it, share it. Uh, certainly subscribe to Poem Praise 2. And uh, be blessed. And I'll talk with you soon. Later, y'all.